going to start this one, Anna, with a personal story. Mm. Back in the 1970s, a very shy five-year-old Kevin Schmeezing left Aww. home to attend school for the first time. But he was welcomed to the kindergarten of Holy Angel School in Sydney, Ohio, by a gentle teacher named Sister Beverly Ann. She, along with our principal, Sister Pat, were members of the congregation of the Sisters of Charity of Cincinnati. The Sisters of Charity had their beginning in the United States, as many listeners will know, when St. Elizabeth Ann Seton founded the order in Emmitsburg, Maryland in 1809. A group of sisters came to Cincinnati 20 years later. And then in the 1850s, the Emmitsburg Sisters decided to affiliate formally with the Daughters of Charity in France. Some of the Cincinnati group thought this would bring unwelcome changes of various kinds, which they believed were not in keeping with the spirit of Mother Seton. And they had a supporter in Cincinnati, in Archbishop John Baptist Purcell. So with the bishop's assistance and led by Sister Margaret George, seven sisters formed a new institute, the Sisters of Charity of Cincinnati. They took their vows in the new congregation this week, March 25th, 1852. There are many remarkable personalities and achievements in the time since are too many to list now, but I'll mention one exceptional figure. I know you're familiar with her. Sister Blandina Sigali, the oh, fastest nun in the West, whose exploits we covered a few months back, I think it was. Sisters of Charity were nurses during the Civil War, parochial assistants of many kinds, educators at every level. Their numbers peaked at 1,600 in the 1960s, but like many religious orders, they have sadly been in decline for several decades, but there are still over 500 of them, and whatever their future may hold, their past displays an impressive record of education and charitable activity. The Sisters of Charity of Cincinnati, this week, 1852. Hi, this is Anna Mitchell from the Sunrise Morning Show. Thanks for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe so we can share more special content with you. And connect with us as well at sunrisemorningshow.com. That's S-O-N, risemorningshow.com.